All right guys, so we have kind of been hitting out today. I went to World Market to get a, like a drawer, I don't know, like a cabinet basically for some organization in the camper. They didn't have it. I've been looking for it for like a year, never can find it in stores. Um, so then we had lunch, it was all right. And um, it was a Mexican place, it was okay. It was okay. All right. Wasn't the best, but it was good. Yeah. It wasn't busy. Yeah, it wasn't busy, so down, that was nice. The downtown part of uh, Fort Collins was busy. Yeah. So now we're headed back into like the kind of shopping area. I'm gonna grab a couple things I need at Sephora, and then I don't know where we're gonna go next. So, just a shopping day, errand day. Tomorrow we're gonna go sightseeing, and I think we're gonna go to Estes Park, which I'm really excited about. Got through in a... Uh, Cut, cut. What's up, guys? We just got done in a uh, REI uh, outdoor store. Kayla got some new shoes, some hiking shoes. We're gonna do some hiking tomorrow. Look for my brother a uh, birthday present. We could find them. If some of you guys own these shoes, don't be mad at me. But I've always thought they weren't like the cutest things. But I realized that they might be more practical, so I'm gonna try them. How do you say this? I don't remember how you pronounce it. I obviously don't know anything about them, but I wanted something I can like walk all day in or go from like walking around to like uh, like hiking or more just like on trails or whatever. Into the water. Into the water if need be. So I'm gonna give them a go. I'm excited. I walked around with them um, on in the store and um, they have really good arch support, which I need but I normally don't wear. We found a guitar center, so we also needed a capo. So we came in here to get that and we found a strap, maybe a hard case, and now we're just looking at all these beautiful guitars just for fun. And I think I need to try to learn how to play the ukulele. Do you guys think I can do it? I think Austin's gonna come back and try to play some of these. Are you in heaven? I don't know about that, but it's pretty cool. Yeah. Oh, there's a pretty narrow one. Don't you think that's pretty? Okay, so, all right, so we just got out of Guitar Center and uh, conveniently purchased <laughs> this hard case. Pulled one of them, uh, what do you call it, neck breakers. We saw the store and I've been needing a capo for my guitar. And uh, so we swung in here and uh, we we're inside and I was like, oh, I need a hard case too, so. So we got it. You think? Because it was on sale it. and we were here. And then whenever we walked out, I said, probably should have thought about that because we're in a single cab, so. Did you even tell them while we're in my truck? No, not yet. Give it to me. Oh, put it on this. This is bigger than the car, so. Look at her, she's about to jump out. She's about to jump out. All right, so here we are. I'm gonna have to move it obviously because it's over the steering wheel, but I did, we're in Austin's truck because my truck, the truck engine light came on as I think you guys know from the last vlog. And um, our mechanic, our friends from home, said that if it starts running rough to wait till we take it in to drive it anymore. And it was running a little rough. So we decided to Air on the side of caution, leave it there, and drive the single cab around, which is probably my least favorite thing to do, especially for Aaron Day, because we've been, like, the floorboard is filled with shopping bags, and then now we're gonna hold this, but I think we only have, like, a 45 minute drive. We good, we good. <laughs> so, anyways, but Austin's been needing one of these, so every time we travel, we have to throw it on the bed or something and like put pillows around it so it doesn't get messed up. So, and then it still gets like out of tune. So I think he'll be happy having one of these for his little guitar. So, I mean for his manly guitar. 
Okay, <laughs> we're going back to the camp for now.